Alright guys, welcome back to this part. This part is about a paint, which is basically pretending to attack. It's not gonna be a long part and you don't have to do this. Because it's also not, not that good, not gonna lie. Uh, but yeah, you don't have to do it. If you don't want to, just skip this part and yeah, go on to the next part. Next part is mobile support. So yeah. Uh, yeah, you can already see, already see here. It's mobile support. I already made it. Haven't, reco haven't recorded it. I mean, I haven't recorded it, but yeah. Still need to edit it. But, um, let's first get some newer stuff up here. The so, last mouse button. Uh, last mouse button. Uh, one press. Is zero. Ah, oh, press. Uh, nicht lost. <laughs> Last. Uh, then local time to paint. Uh, we set it at point three. And then local paint debounce. This falls. Uh, the time to paint is basically, yeah how long you have to paint after you attacked. For me it just can be a uh, point three because my attacks are very fast. Like my animations are uh, I'm always attacking very early. So I just have a very very small time uh, paint window. You need to adjust that to your animations. But then uh, we're gonna here to uh, last uh, last mouse bu button one pressed is tick so it's pretty much counting then here if key dot user input uh, is enum dot user input type mouse button two so we're gonna set our faint button to just mouse button 2 to the right mouse button then uh, our local time since mouse button button 1 is tick minus last mouse button 1 pressed Okay, then if time since mouse button 1 is smaller or equal to time to paint uh, and not and debounce, then we are gonna do the paint. Um, okay. Uh, so, how we're gonna do the paint? Basically, we're just gonna fire the server again. But let's type paint in here. So, we have uh, yeah, a value that we're gonna pass to the server. Or a string that we pass to the server. And then we make the paint demons too here. And it's even be a bit fancy. Uh, I don't think I have to find the camera up here, but uh, you haven't done it yet. But I already did it, so you can define the camera here. Just like that. Your camera is game workspace code camera. And uh, here, task.spawn function. You're just gonna make like a zoom out of. Uh, yeah. And I'm just gonna zoom out the camera just to be a bit fancy. And then I, I don't know if you have to find that too, but local treat service is game get service treat service. So local TS is game get service treat service. By the way, I'm sorry if I sound sick. I'm I'm just sick. Uh, yeah. So treat service created. And then our camera. Then treat oh, treat info dot new. Two point three. Uh, point three. So the time it takes to treat. Then our enum dot 
easing style is, mm, I would say, quad. Then our enum dot easing direction is in and out. And then the comma. And we want to train the field of of view, which we are gonna train to eighty five. And then we are gonna play that. Then after the point three seconds, we are just gonna make the same tween but go back to 70s which is the normal set this to exponential if you want to and i'm gonna make the tween last 0.5 seconds and then let's make another uh, task of made 0.7 because then we want to want to set the faint debounce to false again and we just want uh Paint debounce in general, so we can't spam painting. I also don't even know if this paint is balanced or anything, but yeah. Okay, this is how it looks for now. Yeah, it doesn't stop your attack, uh, but we're gonna script that now. So, uh, go in your comment server script. This before was the common client. Then, you see, we are firing this. Uh, remote again here with our hand string. Then go in here, type uh, after the player a comma, and then action. And then we're gonna do here after all of this. If if action is hand, then we are just gonna stop a minute and. Animations again with server combat module that stop animations and our humanoid. Then we're gonna. Alright, I forgot to tell you. You don't have to, but I suggest you create a new animation. In animations, then sort. And then in your attacking folder, I put a paint animation. <laughs> yeah. Then let's do after that humanoid dot. Animator load animations and um, animations dot sort dot attacking dot paint and play. I got a question uh, what is the animator? A uh, human animator, it's basically just an instance of the humanoid. Uh, which is just a newer way to load the animations onto a, onto a humanoid. So yeah. Uh, yeah. Your dummies may not have that. So you maybe have to put that in your dummies. Just so you know. Okay. Then. Let's do the password spawn function. <coughs> I'm sorry. Uh, and if our characters uh, combo is not four, then uh, if you're wondering how I do this, it's control, old, and then the plus. That's how I do this one. I don't know about other keyboards, but yeah. Um, and task dot let's put a small task dot bait here and then let's set our characters attribute uh, set attribute and get attribute set attribute our attacking to false and our swing to false too so they can swing again because they just pretended to swing first and then else so if our combo is the last combo and they paint that, we're gonna do a longer, longer time until they can attack again. So one second. Uh, and then let's also, uh, you can create your paint sound. I have one in SFX, then sword and paint. And we're just gonna copy the code from here. 
to play this pain sound. So let's call this pain sound. Bam, bam, bam. And wait for child paint. <coughs> and it lasts a little bit longer because my paint sound is. Oh no, my paint sound is actually just not even one second long. Okay. Let's try that out. Okay, I was actually recording. <laughs> Yep, you see, it works. Uh, it could work better for your animations, but yeah, my animations are just that short. Painting doesn't really work that well. But yeah. Uh, thanks for watching. Next part of the set is mobile support. We're gonna make mobile support for. This. I can I can always show you the mobile support how it's gonna look. Uh, because like I, I already made it. Uh, yeah, that's how the mobile support is gonna look. I'm not really good with your eye, but yeah, I'm still gonna have to make the fence button for the mobile support. But yeah, that's pretty much the mobile support. Okay, then thanks for watching. Have a nice day.